Hey, hi, hello. My name is Shandy and I'm your independent Scentsy consultant. And today it's whiff box time. I got so excited when part of this got spoiled and I literally ran to order it myself. There's actually two things in here that I was like, I need right now. So with that being said, let's open it. So this is June 23 or 2023, sorry. June 2023 box and it is a decent sized box like yeah so it is themed with travel I have opened it I'm spoiling that because I kid you not when it came in I probably waited a solid five minutes before I parked my car and almost ripped the box open <laughs> so I'm very excited and there's only a little bit of time left where this is available. So if you need this, order it. Because, yeah. So I'm actually just gonna go away for good. So that that is her. So I'm just gonna pull this off to the side, <clears throat> clear my throat, and read. So it is travel theme this month. So it says, let's be adventurers. And on the back, it shows different languages. I don't know how to talk, but there's a little description focus. And it says, pack your bags. We filled your June with box with fun finds for wherever the journey takes you. These travel-ready products and vacation-inspired scents keep any adventure fragrant and fresh. The only question is, where to next? And right now, to open. <laughs> so, with that being said... I'm going to go with the first thing I got so excited about. It is a little mini fan diffuser in cheetah print. And if you know me personally, you know I am not a huge animal print person. But the way my inner child squealed at the thought of having something. I'm just going to grab it. Really? Sorry. The three-year-old's excited about Mario right now. Anyways, so this is the fan diffuser. It... Like I said, I got way too excited and I opened it in my car. It was all packaged pretty, like the cord was in there. It does not come attached, it does detach. So if you need a longer cord, you could. But this is the cord it comes with. It, yeah, like I said, it comes apart. I'm probably gonna put this back in my car. And it's such a cute little animal print. And it's limited only to June's whip box, so. We have that. Super cute. And it, yeah, there's instructions somewhere in the box. And, um, my brain. So, another item that I was super excited about was the pods in pink rhubarb sugar. This scent is like candy to me. It's so good. So, like I said, I did already open and use this. So, I'm just going to show you how I've learned how to do this. So, the pod. This goes in your little diffuser. It literally just sits, but it comes off. So there are labels with it. I'm out. I'm not going to use this one, but see, there's a label for it. I have mine right here. So I was going to assemble it and pretend like I didn't open the box, but let's be honest, I'm way too excited for that. But anyways, you take the sticker off and you put it on and then look, it doesn't come out. I thought that was such a handy trick. And now you guys know. <laughs> so, pink rhubarb sugar. Really good scent. Um, as far as I remember, the scent description is just literally rhubarb and sugar. So, oh, I like the catalog. <laughs> I'm a smart person today. I'm really tired. Okay, so pink rhubarb sweetened with sparkling raspberry and an extra scoop of sugar. So... That's probably why I'm obsessed with it, honestly. So, I'm going to not mix things up. Uh, okay. Uh, how are you guys? I'm super tired. Uh, all right. The next item on my thing, I'm going to put the description here. Or read the description, because I was smart and put a catalog next to me. This is in the floral family. This is the next item is kikui and coconut. I'm pretty sure I'm pronouncing that wrong. 
So it's tropical coconut and kukui nut lounge on a bed of soft jasmine. And I do love this scent. It's a nice kind of almost like a mix of floral and wood. So it is nice. And way back at the beginning of my scentsy journey, I never liked woods, never liked spices, stuck to fruits and fresh. And I have ventured so far since becoming a consultant, I'm open to try anything. So superb, superb. Um, actually, we'll do this one. So uh, the next item in here is Blue Grotto in the Travel Twist. And it is very nice and strong. I had the Gogo -Go Mango in my laundry room, which is kind of a medium open concept. That lasted for a good month. And I had it probably about that. So with the Travel Twist, you can control how strong you have it because it's just oil in a felt circle. And yeah, Blue Grotto also is a really good scent. So it says, run away with fresh tropical notes, sweet citrus, and lush botanicals. This one is really good for the car, travel trailer, you know. This is really good travel themed. With your mini diffuser, you can put it in your car, you can have it at your desk. It's endless possibilities. The other two items in the whiff box, I'm going to go with this one because this last one was the other reason why I ordered the box. So I got a bar of mango matcha and when i first smelt this i thought it was going to be more green so i was really nervous about it but it's really good so it's a mix of mango nectar and matcha sorbet topped with a slice of salted cucumber and a dash of pure sugar cane it smells so good oh so yummy the mango definitely overpowers the cucumber and the sugar cane and it has that little hint of like a green to it. So very nice. Very, very nice. Last item was the other reason why I ordered the whiff box. And that is July's scent of the month. And that is Tahelion Twilight. And I have the scent description here. I was I prepared. I literally prepared. So it's a gentle wave of coastal waters bring together flirty passion flower, pineapple, and white woods for an evening in paradise. I'm really excited to put this in my warmer. So good. I feel like it's trying to imitate like a bed and bath scent somehow or bed and body or whatever. I don't go there. You can tell. <laughs> um, I feel like it's trying to mock like a body wash that have smelt there but I can't think of what but it smells really good and it's like I've smelt it before it's really good I feel like if you like um I would say really light fruity scents I might go with this I am curious how it's gonna do warm so I'm gonna be doing a few cubes and I'm gonna save some for samples for my customers but I will be coming back with my um, what I've been warming and I will talk about this so yeah that is June's whiff box and it was a good one so I'm so happy that I got it and then I'm probably gonna put my fam back in my car because I'm obsessed so with that being said I will see you guys in the next video